it is redemption time. Welcome back everyone. Today I've got another box of 2021 Upper Deck Series 1 Hockey and I've got another overtime pack. Uh, yeah, this was, uh, I wasn't gonna get a second box, but my first box was pretty underwhelming to be honest. I was very happy to get the Alex Belzil. I mean, the Timothy Liljegren was decent, but uh, upon looking at uh, the eBay sold listings, it was a uh, very disappointing box, but uh, gonna try to make up for it today. This is the last hope at getting a uh, Lafreniere Young Guns in a hobby box, but I'm gonna start off with an overtime wave one pack. Let's just see if I can hit any very cool uh, little bonus here in the overtime pack. That would be uh, a good start to the video, but uh, we'll have to see. We've got uh, William Carlson and then Elias Lindholm, Ryan Dezingle, and a center of excellence of Sean Monaghan. So once again, nothing too incredible there. But uh, yeah, that's that for the little bonus. Let's jump in to the hobby box. Okay, so I've completely destroyed this box, but uh, we don't really care about the box because, uh, yeah, what we really care about is that uh, are the uh, cards inside. Um, and sorry about hitting the uh, stand there, but uh, yeah, <laughs> I've got the little uh, Synergy Bounty program there. And um, this time, how about we uh, change things up a little? I'm gonna take the uh, four stacks out and uh, place them all individually here and then uh, we're gonna keep the box on the right side and so we're gonna see uh, where the young guns fall in all of our packs right here and uh, close up the box I'm gonna leave it here on the right side it's completely ruined but that doesn't really matter we're gonna get six young guns in this box we've got 24 packs and uh, we do have eight cards per pack now I definitely expect this product to absolutely explode in price uh, so I definitely recommend buying some very soon if you haven't already because it's going to be very similar to a 15, 16, I think. Uh, super just crazy expensive. But uh, without further ado, let's jump into this. Hopefully, Ila Fennel is going to be somewhere in this box. We've got Colin White, Nick Dowd, William Nylander. <gasps> yeah, okay, wow, I'll take that. Nicholas Bodine, Young Guns Exclusives, number 95 of 100. Okay, <laughs> Oh, okay, I'll take that. I mean, Bodin, I'm pretty sure he might have been a first-round pick. Um, really young guy. Uh, yeah, he's 21, I think, now, if my math is correct. But uh, that could be really massive if he uh, becomes a really good defenseman for the Blackhawks. Wow, what a first pack. I will take that, absolutely. That's a bonus young gun right there. And an exclusives, number 95 of 100. Then we got Yenny Gould, Miller, and then Jonathan Taze. Look at that shot. And then Artemi Panarin. So, yeah, that's a good start. I'm, uh, wow. I mean, that is, that's just really impressive. I'm going to keep going down this uh, top left stack here. And, uh, wow, that is, I mean, that's already better than the uh, first box was. So, uh, wow. Let's just keep this going. We've got Keith Yandel, Alec Martinez, Connor Garland, Philip Zadina, and a Jason Robertson Young Guns. So two for two on the Young Guns for the uh, Dallas Stars. Not bad, Jason Robertson. And then we got uh, Abdul Kader Stamkos and Patrick Hornquist. Okay, that's very nice. I'm very pleased with uh, a Young Guns exclusives. I think that uh, if he does pan out, that could be a fantastic card. And uh, do we have something thicker here? I don't know. It seems like we might. Um, Tevo Teravainen, UC Saros. John Tavares, and no, it's a uh, Tuka Rask UD Portraits. Okay, that's a pretty decent card. And then uh, we've got Samsonov, Palmieri, Miller, and Zabinajad. Actually, I'll put the Portraits aside. I'll keep our Young Guns down there and uh, maybe put the Portraits and other inserts a little higher so we can separate those right there. Okay, let's keep on going. Pack number four, we've hit two Young Guns. We're going to get uh, six. Actually, we're going to get seven in this box now. Uh, six of the regular ones for sure, but uh, now we got the bonus exclusives one. So that's pretty nice. We've got uh, Comfer, Kessel, Hurdle, another Young Guns here. And it's a very good one, Pavel Fransos. Uh My brother's going to want this one, that's for sure. 
uh, Colorado Avalanche backup goaltender. But uh, look at those stats. I mean, he had a pretty monster season uh, with Colorado. So that's a very nice young gun to get. Wow. Uh, very happy with that. Thomas O'Reilly, Kopitar, and Brandon Tanev. Uh, wow. I picked up this box at uh, one of my favorite local card stores, Game Zetera Orleans. Um, and, uh, yeah, I just want to give a little shout out to them because, uh, I'm already pretty satisfied with, uh, the box, but I don't want all the goodness to stop right here. Let's keep on going. Ellis, Rask, Carter, Dubé, and a Sebastian Ajo UD canvas. Not bad. And, uh, let's put that right up here. And then we've got Stone, Alex Stalock. I like that shot a lot. If it's going to focus. Yeah, that's really nice. And then, uh, Kaylor Yamamoto. Okay, uh, so sixth pack already. Sorry about hitting the stand there. Uh, but we're finishing off the top left stack. And uh, let's see if we can get maybe another young gun here. What do we have? I think an NHL Worldwide. Chikrin, Nelson, and Tavo Teravine. And I got this exact card in my first box. Is it only him in this uh, checklist? <laughs> um, Mitch Marner, Landis Cog, Morrissey, and Connor Brown. Okay, uh, I think we're going to go top right this time. To uh, just keep things going. Let's see if we can hit anything else here. I think maybe another portraits. Oh no, Dazzlers here. Anisimov, Coleman, Johansson, Dylan Strom, and Nikita Kucherov. Dazzlers, blue parallel. I got, uh, or actually the blue is the regular one, but uh, I got his uh, pink one in the first box of this that I opened up. Uh, Mike Riley, Bjorkstrand, and Jordan Binnington fighting off a puck. Okay. So uh, this has been a pretty exciting start to the video. I think uh, we've got two of our promised regular young guns so far, and then an exclusive. And we've got another one right here. Adam Fox, Tyler Sagan, Braden Point. Yeah, no way, Jake Evans, young guns. I've hit my two halves in uh, my two boxes. That is so sick. I'm so happy with that. Jake Evans, he was a 7th round pick back in 2014, and uh, I mean, such a hard-working guy. He made it up to the uh, Habs last year and uh, played a bit on the 4th line, and he looked really impressive. Uh, wow, that's a sick card. Very pleased with that one, and I'll just gently put it down on uh, the side there. Carlo, the checklist, and then Pearson, and Evgeny Malkin. Alright, I mean... So far, this box has uh, been very good, i got to say. Uh, an exclusive Young Guns, I can't remember what the other one was, but then we got a Fransos and a Jake Evans, which is pretty sick. We've got Gensel, Ovechkin, Gusev, Quinn Hughes, and a Leon Dreisaitl UD Portraits. They look so funky this year, <laughs> but uh, in a good way. I mean, uh, last few years were a little dull, but uh, I'm a big fan of the look this year. Hamilton and Boone Jenner. I mean, that is so cool. I've now uh, scratched off both Habs Young Guns that I needed uh, to uh, collect this season. So that is pretty awesome. Let's see what we're going to get here. We've got uh, Dmitry Orlov, Braden Shen, Colton Pareko, Adrian Kempe, Oh, that's very nice as well. Peyton Krebs Young Guns for the Vegas Golden Knights. This is another one that could turn out to be a, a very good card. That is awesome. Peyton Krebs for uh, the Golden Knights. Former first round pick. And then we've got uh, Thatcher Demko. Great shot. And then uh, Danton Heinen and Zach Sanford. Okay, two packs to go on the uh, top right stack. And uh, wow, what a uh, great box so far. Let's keep this going. We've got uh, John Marino, Riley Smith, and then Matt Zuccarello, and a Quinn Hughes UD Canvas. We are all Canucks. Very nice second year card for Quinn Hughes. And then we've got uh, Blake Wheeler, Timo Meyer, Mark Stahl, and David Pasternak. I mean, this box has definitely been a lot more solid than the uh, first one was, so... I'll give it that for sure. That was, uh, the first one was pretty brutal. We've got uh, Darnell Nurse, Alex Kerfoot, Nazem Kadri, Nikolai Ehlers, and we've got a uh, Kirby Doc debut dates, October 20th, 2019, versus the Blackhawks. And uh, that, oh, that's pretty cool. They show his uh, stats in that game. Uh, not much to show for, but uh, I mean, a Ryan Paling one would be pretty cool considering he got uh, a hat trick as well as a shootout uh, game winner. Um, in that first game of his. All right, let's uh, keep on going. We're uh, just halfway through this opening. Pavel Zaka, uh, Jason Zucker, and Kyle Connor, UD game jersey. 
I did not expect a thicker card to come out here, but uh, that is very nice. Kyle Connor, UD Game Jersey. Put that uh, right at the top. Now we've got Callie Yarncroft, Ben Bishop, and David Riddick. Okay, keep on going. That is a very nice bonus to get. Uh, UD Game Jersey, and Kyle Connor is super underrated. People definitely uh, just completely underrate him. I think he's an amazing player. We've got uh, Jonathan Bernier, and then uh, William Carlson, Alex DeBrinket, Brady Shea, and a predominant of, there you go, Kyle Connor showing up once again. I like the uh, back of these. All right, and then we've got uh, Miles Wood, Franz Nielsen, and Philippe Grubauer. There you go. Nice focus there. Okay, keep on... Flying through this opening, let's see what we can uh, get. I believe we're only guaranteed one more young gun. Maybe it's two, but uh, I'm not quite sure. Clefbaum, Raquel Weber, and uh, Bobrovsky. Any Thomas Shabbat UD portraits. Very nice looking. And then we've got a Kasperi Kapanen, supposed to be on Pittsburgh. Essa Lindell and TJ Oshi. He might go to uh, St. Louis. I've heard some uh, rumors of that maybe happening. I mean, that would be probably a very good fit. I, uh been watching some highlights in the uh, past few weeks with uh, no hockey going on well at least no NHL hockey I just watched his amazing shootout in the uh, Olympics against uh, Russia that was just amazing he scored like four goals on six attempts uh, Truba, Pavelski, Ayafalo and a Mackenzie Blackwood rookie retrospective now these look really cool um, yeah I mean they remind me a bit of a Panini insert but uh can't remember exactly which one. They look really nice, though. Suter, McAvoy, Saad, and Tomas Tatar. If uh, he can... Yeah, there you go. That's the focus I was looking for. All right. <laughs> Let's keep on going. Uh, maybe a clear cut. I haven't hit any of those in uh, this year's set. Uh, that would be pretty nice. We've got Nick Letty, Elvis Merzlikens. That almost looks like his uh, Young Guns rookie card. Could that be? Is that uh, possible that that actually is? It's not focusing, but uh, there you go. Is that his young guns? I actually I don't think so, but uh, be funny if it were. Peter Mrazek and oh, very nice <laughs> young guns canvas of Pierre Olivier Joseph for the Pittsburgh Penguins, former first round pick of the Arizona Coyotes. That is a nice card. I mean, the design is fabulous, and that means we're gonna get a total of eight young guns in this box: Sanheim, and then Backlund, Barkov, and Travis Konechny. What a solid box. And also, my base stack is falling down on the right, which, uh-oh. Gotta fix this real quickly. Uh. <laughs> okay, so I've just about picked all of these up. Yeah, my base stack was uh, just falling down like crazy. We're just finishing up now the bottom left stack, which means after this one, we'll only have six packs to go in this uh, very expensive uh, Upper Deck Series 1 hobby box. And I think we've got another Young Guns here. We've got Gallagher, Lindholm, Eichel, and then uh, Mathieu Perrault. And we've got Joel Kiviranta. Oh, let's go, Young Guns. He scored uh, four goals, I believe it was. Maybe it was only three, but it was against uh, the Colorado Avalanche in uh, the... Uh, Stanley Cup playoffs. Actually, I can't even remember if it was against Colorado, but uh, actually I think it was just a hat trick if I remember, but it was the OT winner as well. So that's a pretty good young gun to get. James Neal, Dwayne, and Tony D'Angelo. Let's go. I believe it's uh, six packs to go um, before uh, we're all done, but uh, I mean, this has been very solid. Uh, I can't even open this pack. Come on, let's uh, gently get these cards out. Don't want to damage anything. All right, so we've got Mr. Philip Dano, Semyon Varlamov, Rocco Grimaldi, Sakurensky, Victor Hedman, and actually, there you go. This is one of the French variation base cards. So uh, that's pretty cool. One of the French base card variations. Uh, yeah, that's pretty awesome. And then uh, Dvorak, Jean-Gabriel Pajot, and Nikita Zaitsev. I did uh, miss one in my first box of that, but uh, yeah. They are a little hard to spot. Um, if you do get a base pack, it's probably because you have uh, one of those. And uh, yeah, we've got Lindholm, Subban, Larkin, and a Brady Kachuk predominant. Very nice. And then we've got Lars Eller, and then Morgan Riley, Vitrano, and Nate Schmidt. So four packs to go. Anything else? I mean, probably some more predominant cards. Um, maybe another Young Guns? I don't know. Um... Yeah, I actually can't remember what we're uh, still missing. Maybe another canvas card and uh, maybe a portraits as well. 
Samir Girard, very nice photo actually, and then uh, Hyman Klingberg, and a very nice Timothy Liljegren, UD Portraits Rookies. That is quite nice for the uh, Toronto Maple Leafs. And then a Goligoski, Cassian, and then Kirby Duck, and then a Will Butcher base card. So only three to go. Any Alexis Lafrenière in here, or will I have to uh, try again, maybe at the retail level? Let's see. We've got uh, Matthew Kachuk, Nick Foligno, Jared Spurgeon, Charlie Coyle, and another NHL worldwide, this one of Leon Dreisaitl for Germany. This one's a little nicer looking than the uh, Tear of Vinen, in my opinion. Matt Duchesne, Aaron Ekblad, and Eunice Donskoy. Okay, two to go. I don't know what to expect in here. I'm pretty sure we are missing another young gun, but I uh, might be completely wrong on that assumption. Let's see, though. We've got, uh, ooh, I don't know. Connor Murphy, Nick Suzuki, second year card. That's a really cool shot. And uh, once again, it's not... Uh, not focusing. There you go. Uh, and then we've got Ivan Provorov, Rasmus Ristolainen, and a Zakwarenski UD Canvas celebrating a goal right there. And then uh, that was his hat trick, I'm guessing, because of the uh, three pucks he's holding in the back. Kemper, and then Jones, and Philippe Forsberg. All right, last pack. Any last pack mojo here? Let's finish off this opening on a high note. It's been a very good one. And I think, I don't know, is that a Young Guns I see? Uh, I think. Don't know. Yes, that is a Young Guns. Let's see. What do we have here? Achari, Kevin Hayes, Connor McDavid, and a Ryan McLeod Young Guns to finish it off. Second round pick a few years back. That is a decent card for sure. I'll take that. Uh, this box was definitely a step up from uh, the last one. Then we've got Darlene, Doughty, Hannafin, and Carter Hart to finish things off. There you go. That was this opening. That was... Uh, Definitely solid. Let's jump into the insert recap. So to recap this opening, we got a lot of inserts. We've got a canvas of Wierenski NHL Worldwide of Dreisaitl, uh, UD Portraits Rookies of Liljegren, predominant of Kachuk. Got a French variation of Victor Hedman and then a rookie retrospective of Mackenzie Blackwood. Thomas Shabbat, UD Portraits, and then a Kyle Connor, predominant, a, a debut dates of Kirby Doc, and then a Quinn Hughes, UD Canvas. Got a UD Portraits of Dreisettle, a Kucherov Blue Dazzlers, a Tevo Teravine in NHL Worldwide, as well as a Sebastian Ajo Canvas, a Tuka Rask, UD Portraits, and then a jersey of a UD Game jersey of Kyle Connor. And then the Young Guns, we got eight in this box. Ryan McLeod, Joel Kiviranta, Pierre-Olivier Joseph, Canvas Young Guns, Peyton Krebs, Jake Evans for my Habs, Pavel Fransos, Jason Robertson, and a Young Guns exclusives of Nicholas Bodine, or maybe Bodine, I'm not quite sure, but uh, number 95 out of 100. You actually cannot see that at all because there you go, the focus was on McDavid in the back, and it still is. <laughs> so uh, there you go. That was a massive step up from the last one. I'm super pleased with this box. Um, that's just, yeah, I'll take this. I mean, I'm very happy. I, it would have been better to uh, get a Lafreniere, of course, but if you're not going to get a Lafreniere, this is probably what you want. A very good haul of, uh, I mean, great cards. So uh, that was the video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave me a comment down below. Tell me what your favorite card was of this opening. Mine has to be the uh, Jake Evans Young Gun. I mean, I, that was one I was going to have to buy off of eBay. Now I don't have to, so uh, there you go. That uh, works out for me in the end. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video. And as always, I hope to see you all next time.